A number of superintendents across the valley are teaming up and asking the TEA for an extension to virtual learning. CBS 4's Karina Vargas explains the changes they want to make. The safety and security of our staff and our, and our students and families, to be frank, is our number one priority, right? With the holidays right around the corner, Region 1 superintendents are asking TEA to allow them to go 100% virtual for at least four weeks after the winter break. For a few weeks, um, maybe to have virtual instruction, the students will be learning from home um, and allow us, and that way will allow us to have maybe um, some flexibility with the staff who will be working also on site. In a letter to Commissioner Mike Morath, they expressed their concerns over the rise in COVID-19 cases. Superintendents worry about the repercussions that could be taken. Flexibility temporarily, right, is just to allow uh, us to teach virtually without losing funding or asking us to make up the time later in, in the summer. Donna ISD Superintendent Dr. Azaiz was one of the superintendents who wrote the letter. He says this will only be a temporary situation until they minimize the spread and adds this is all for the well-being of the students and faculty. Have fewer students or no students on, on site um, to minimize that, that risk, but we will, we will revert back and go back to teaching and offering parent choice right after that. That's the goal. Superintendents across the valley are hoping to get an answer by Commissioner Morath by tomorrow before they go on winter break. Working for you in Donna, I'm Karina Vargas.